Did you ever play marbles as a kid? I never even owned marbles, but that doesn't mean they can't serve as a source of inspiration. If EOS could be anything, what would it be? Marbles. Why not? Grab your nearest EOS and let's get marbling. First, locate this dividing line. Using a knife or box cutter, start jabbing into this area until the inner set pops out. It might get messy and take a couple tries, but you'll get there eventually. Slice off any of the lip balm to use in your recipe. Divide the amount into however many Dixie cups as the number of colors you'd like. Along with my full EOS, I'm going to add a tad bit of beeswax and coconut oil into each cup. I'm just eyeballing the amount here, just make sure to go easy on the coconut oil. I'm doing this to make sure I don't run out of the lip balm when I start pouring, since some of it will get stuck to the sides of the cups. You can add an eyeshadow or a lipstick to give a color. I recommend using colors with high contrast so the marble design shows up a lot. Here I'm setting my cups in heat safe bowls to make cleanup easier. You can just add in your lip balm straight to the bowl if you like. Fill a pan with some water then set your bowls inside. Let it all heat up until all the contents inside melt. Next, set the top lid into the bottom lid so it's stable. You'll need a toothpick or skewer to mix up the lip balm. After we pour in the lip balm, we're going to scrape our marble design against the top cap using a heavy hand. You have to scrape it because the first layer of lip balm against the cap will likely already be hardening. This helps make holes in the surface to allow the other colors to seep through and become visible. The first color you pour in will be the general color of your lip balm. Pour in about half the cap, then add in the second color. Now carve in your design with your skewer. This part is very much a game of intuition, so just do your best to envision and carve the design. Afterwards, pour in the last color and repeat the carving. Honestly, I wish I would have used a different color because these two colors ended up being too similar and didn't show up very much. Turn the grate upside down, then screw it into the top lid. Then just go ahead and pour in the rest of the lip balm. Pop this into the freezer for 30 minutes. Then go ahead and unscrew the grate and voila! Pop this back into the bottom cap and you're all done. Now you have your own special EOS with all its marbly goodness. Here are some of the other ones I made. The last one was made of just coconut oil and beeswax. Enjoy your lip balm stylers. How do you react when you're angry? Do you tend to blame other people or start to use negative self-talk? The next time that you're angry before doing anything else, I want you to stop yourself and think about something that makes you calm. Whenever I'm frustrated, I always like to think about the movement of clouds. I know that's really random, but it always calms me down. So whether it be the movement of clouds or some other random thing, I want you to stop yourself in the heat of the moment and think about that before making any decisions. Because my friends, a calm mind is a happy mind. If you try this DIY, please go ahead and share your photos with me on all social media using the hashtag DIY with Sophie. Also, please take a moment to follow me on Instagram, Twitter, and like me on Facebook at Sophie Styled. Thank you guys so much for watching. Keep styling.